guys welcome back so i'm gonna warn you in advance that this video this portion that i'm talking right now is actually another shoot because um when i actually reviewed my footage i had like really really bad background noise and yeah i'm trying this with my new condenser down below and if it goes well i'm gonna put down the link before i go so i'm gonna show you the packages that I did unwrap when I got my new package and then um, I actually got like four parcels. The parts where I was talking actually had really bad audio so I just cut to the parts where I was opening the packages and I'm gonna show you some of the books that I got and I'm gonna do this as one round of a go and this is just part of the package okay and the other books that I got from my other hauls, I haven't actually placed in the video. They're all in storage boxes now, so I'll probably do them when I have the time to open up my other storage boxes or when I'm about to read them. So as you guys know, I am selling some of my books and the others I actually get from other book suppliers. Depends on what type of books that I see or I feel like just getting at the moment. We all need to do something and I love books since I do love books. I feel like selling books is one of the things that I would be able to keep on continuing or keep on doing because I like it. I mean I do enjoy it and you know it just actually feels there's this odd feeling when you buy a book even though it's not for yourself you're just really happy and then it's kind of sad to part ways with each book that I sell but you know it's kind of happy as well because you know that you're giving someone else the joy of reading so let's begin unwrapping these I have like four parcels with me yep and that's really heavy <gasps> This is books 4 to 6. I actually got the whole set for like a really good price for myself. And I don't I think it's somewhere here. The books want to see are somewhere here. And look, so pretty. Finally got a set for myself after all these years of just borrowing and yeah.
all right so some of these books that i do have uh i've been looking for for like the longest time i can't find anyone who actually sells them i was looking them i was looking for them for myself so i'll start with this book that i've been looking for for like the longest time and it's a series that i did love as a child and not many actually liked it some others didn't like it and it was turned into a movie and it's now probably a series that i don't find in other bookstores anymore so i give you the complete spider wig chronicles it's still in a plastic and it actually includes the whole first series anyway the first five books and that's the field guide the scene stone Lucinda's Secret, The Ironwood Tree, and The Wrath of Mulgarath. So the Spider Wick Chronicles is by Tony Deterlitzi Litchi Lindsay and the Holly Black. This one, the one I got actually includes three lost chapters available together for the first time, an exclusive making of Spider Wick sketchbook, plus bonus gallery featuring 17 all star artists giving their spin on the world of Spider Wick. For your information, I only got this for like 275 pesos. Of course, besides shipping fee. So I'm going to open it up and show you guys up close what it really looks like inside. And I feel like it's really worth it because this is really rare already at this time. And it's complete and it's really, really cheap. And I'm so happy to finally grab a copy. I'm really the kind of person who judges a book by its cover. Please don't judge me. Because... I don't know, I feel like the cover has to do a lot with the story and the reason why I thought I should get it was because of the covers. And first we have The Unbecoming of Mara Dyer. So if I'm gonna base it on the description, if I'm not mistaken, it's like a thriller and that's really exciting because I love thrillers, fantasies, and horror stories. And next we have The 100 by Cass Morgan. This is sci-fi and for the past few weeks I've actually been thinking of trying to read sci-fi. I haven't tried actually reading any sci-fi at all. So this is one of those books that I'm planning to read. I also have like the Sleeping Giants trilogy and the Space Odyssey and the Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy that I got with the set but uh, I'm not really gonna show it. Because I'm not sure if I'm keeping it anyway. I don't remember how much I got these. But I know that I got them for less like... For 200 or less. If I'm not mistaken. And I'm so excited to read them. She got... I'm only showing you book one. But I got myself the whole Harry Potter Scholastic set. It's not really the set that I want to get. Because I don't really like the covers. But... This is what is accessible to me. I only had like books 1 to 3 and now I have the complete 1 to 7 and I'm replacing those copies. Thank you. They're supposedly part of the Grisha trilogy but obviously I don't have book 3. I only got, I only saw that they have book 1 and <gasps> book 1 and 2. So we have parts of the Grisha trilogy which is, which are Shadow and Bone and siege and storm so according to this apparently alina discovers after recent events alina discovers that she has some magical powers with her and then she goes into training to be able to use her powers for a war which is and she becomes a trainee under the grisha which is a magical elite I feel like these two books are really great reads, especially for fantasy, and it says that it has fantasy and love. So I'm good with fantasy and love, but romance books alone, I'm not really into those kinds of things, so yeah. And then lastly, I've been waiting for this set for like the longest time. Now I have Six of Crows and Crooked Kingdom. I'm so happy to finally get a copy of these two. The reason why I'm actually happy to get these is that um, getting them as a set is really, really expensive. Even though you see them as secondhand books, they sell it like at a really high price. So, I got this for like 700 for both of them. And uh -huh, I'm so happy. for 
And thank you very much guys for watching. I hope to see you guys soon on my social media, on my Twitter, on my bookstagram. You guys can follow me on my links down below. And you can also follow our shop where we also sell some of our pre-love books. I hope to see you guys soon and please do subscribe to my channel and like this video if you did enjoy it. Bye!